So, I've been trying to track down um, for whatever reason this this vocal track just isn't it doesn't sound right and I can't get anything good come out of it. So I took a noise print from the high frequencies which is, I mean that's often where you're going to find some stuff screwing with things because as, as that sums or you know hits a compressor or limiter or whatever it's going to start to come out if it's within an audible hearing range and this is the noise print I got from it and I looked at that and I thought hmm that looks vaguely suspicious so then hooked up my old pal Ozone Insight and that looks I mean the scale is going to be a little weird here but that looks a lot like uh, frequency shaped uh, noise from uh, dithering and actually looking back over here at a more sort of um, uh, you know reasonable thing you can kind of see right here it's got the noise floor cranked way down to really pointlessly low levels um, and it has that distinct shape there and uh, the solution to this is a uh, is this button on the keyboard here which is yeah go away And now it can work. If you're going to use dithering, use good dithering and don't use it until your final pass. Don't dither stems, people.